So guys, before this video starts, I just want to mention that I dropped some new merch. And as you can see on the screen right there, we've got some t-shirts, different designs, some hoodies that look really cool, and all of that good stuff. So the link is in the description down below. Check it out right now if you guys haven't already. What's up, guys? Welcome back to another video. Today, I'm going to be showing you guys the Portal Gun mod in Minecraft Podition. So if you guys enjoyed this video, definitely go ahead, smash the like button right now. If you are new to the channel, be sure to subscribe and turn on those notifications so you don't miss a video. So you might be wondering, Fusion, what's up with all these blocks? Here, uh, well, I placed them obviously, <laughs> and I will show you guys very soon what this is to do with. Um, it's pretty cool actually. So, let's go into this chest, and as you can see, we have the portal guns right here. Now, you can of course craft it if you're in survival. So, let me just quickly show you guys the uh, the crafting recipe right there. As you can see, it's pretty much there, but let's just craft it so you guys can see that it does indeed work. So, this is just for a normal portal, right? So, the um, portal gun. So with the Eye of Ender, you want to place it up the top left, just like that. And with the Obsidian, you just want to kind of place it around just like this. There we go. And with the Iron Ingot, just place it there. And as you can see, now we have a portal gun and boom. We are ready to use this bad boy. So um, yeah, very cool. And the next one is this portal gun right here. So let's just get the, uh, the recipe for that. Now, if you want to craft the second item, pretty much you want the Eye of Ender up the top once again. Uh, with the iron ingots, just kind of do exactly what I'm doing right here. And with the glass, bam, bam, and there we go. Very, very simple. Uh, you guys can pause the video or whatever if you want to make it. Uh, but yeah, now we have two portal guns. And, um, well, there is a uh, this one right here. It's called a portal gun black hole. Now, you can't actually craft it. Now, to get this, what you want to do is, you know, type in this command, slash give at P... And you just want to type in portal gun and as you can see it gives you all of them right here So you can quickly go ahead and give yourself that right there and boom as you can see now We just gave it to ourselves. So they're very, very easy, but let's go ahead and actually, you know, play around with these So let's just um, hmm, where should we go with this? You know what? Let's just aim at the street. Bam. There we go <laughs> So this one is the uh, slightly different kind of one uh, as you can see it has like little particles and if we shoot this one as you can see, it is the orange one. So if I was to go in the orange portal, obviously it doesn't look like a portal too much right now, but with the other weapon, uh, you can actually indeed, like, it looks like a normal one. So if I go into this one, and I should be teleported out this tree. So they're very cool. Uh, of course, we can get rid of them by just doing slash kill at E. There we go, it removes it. So basically, this is what it's going to look like constantly. I mean, we can keep shooting this thing, or we can change the color and stuff, but... As you can see, it is still just like this. Now, if you want to make it like a round portal, all you have to do is get a potato out. I uh, know, it sounds a little bit strange, but if you place the uh, portal gun just like that with a potato, as you can see, we get a potato gun. <laughs> now, if we shoot this one, all right, check this out. It looks like a normal portal. And you also get this person talking. Okay, can you relax? There we go. Stop talking now. <laughs> if we shoot it again, we get the blue one. So obviously, if we go through this blue portal, we'll end up on this side right here. So let's just go in. And as you can see, there we go. Very, very nice. Works exactly the same as the uh, portal game, I guess. So very, very nice. And let's actually try this black hole out because it's actually really cool. So let's remove all of the mobs. And we're just going to shoot it right here. All right. So there we go. <laughs> it's a little bit weird with the, the placement, but... That's the black hole, and as you can see, I'm getting sucked up, and that's pretty much what it does. So, let me just quickly get rid of it, so you guys can, uh, have a better look of this one. So, oh, okay, now it just goes back to that. Alright, hang on, hang on. We have to give it to ourselves again, so, give that P, portal gun, and we want the black hole. So, there we go. Let's place it down, and what we're gonna do now, it's a little bit laggy for whatever reason, but it should be okay. So, we're gonna spawn in a bunch of pigs just around it, and as you can see, it gets sucked up, and it dies! Uh, so we can just, you know, spawn in a bunch, and as you can see, it just, you know, dies in a black hole. Very, very insane. I want to see if this black hole kills me. All right, let's just kind of get close, so I'm a little bit scared. Black hole, please. Oh, jeez. Yep, okay. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Wow. Yeah, I like this. I like it a lot. You can maybe, like, prank your friends or something. Just kind of, like, place a van. I'll be like, what is that? 
They'll get close to it and boom, they are dead. <laughs> and of course, you know, the mobs is pretty funny as well. I wonder if it actually gets rid of the Ender Dragon. We might try that very, very soon later on in the video. So now we're going to test out the next portal gun. And this is Rick and Morty's portal gun, I guess you could call it. So pretty much we can aim it just like that. As you can see, it kind of looks like this portal right here. And of course, we can aim it over there and pretty much if we go in it, there we go. We come out the other side. So pretty much this is exactly the same as a uh, normal portal gun, except it obviously looks a little bit different. Uh, and that potato gun is very annoying because it talks to you. So guys, with these blocks right here, currently you can actually lift them up. Yes, you can lift them up with the portal gun, which is just, you know, awesome. But I don't think it's going to work on diamond because it's only these blocks right here that was on the website that, you know, pretty much said it would work. So pretty much what you need to do, right, is you want to hold shift and then you want to like kind of click on it and uh, like go off it. It's a little bit hard at first, but there we go. Oh, okay. Okay. That was a little bit of a mess up. Uh, there we go. Yes. <laughs> so we can lift this up and kind of just, I don't know, we can move it, I guess, uh, kind of sprint with the block. And if you want to place it somewhere, so say we want to place it right next to this tree. All right, what you want to do is press shift. All right, so just like that. And as you can see now, we just place the block. So it's a little bit tricky to lift it up because you have to do like all of this thing where you have to hold shift. You want to like lift it up and then you want to like unshift at the same time. So you have to do it very fast or else it's not going to work. So this is what it looks like if I just hold shift. Uh, we can't really get it. <laughs> so let's try with this block. I don't think it's going to work. Yeah, it doesn't seem to be working at all because, well, it was not on the website. But if we come over here to, say, this block right here, it will work. Um, obviously, we just want to do it very quickly. There we go. Uh, let's place it... Let's place it on here. Oh, okay. Nope. We want to place it right on top of it. It's a little bit hard with the placement, but there we go. Ooh. That was perfect. All right, let's try with the redstone block. So again, just go like that. Uh, did I get it? Oh, there we go. Yes. All right, let's lift it up a little bit and place it there. <laughs> this is so cool. I love this mod. Oh my goodness. Uh, so of course we can try it on, you know, dirt blocks and grass blocks, of course. Uh, we can just kind of place it there. We can have it floating if we really want to. So the next thing I wanted to try was this. All right, let me just quickly kind of build something right here. So we're just going to kind of go a little bit like this, just so we can see the portal a little bit better. And oh geez. Oh no, 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 no. Black portal is trying to kill me. <laughs> So, number one for the experiment, what we're going to do is place a portal right here. So, there we go. And we're going to place one all the way over here. And we want to see if a mob can teleport. So, that was um, an orange one. And we got a blue one. All right, sweet. So, there is no pigs around at the moment right there. I want to quickly just push this one in it. So, boom. <gasps> no, it doesn't work. Wait. Oh, it doesn't teleport into it. Interesting. Oh, wait. No, it does. <gasps> wait, it does. <laughs> yes, it actually worked. Wait, I thought that wasn't going to work for a second. Wait, does it need to be like behind it or something? Come on. Come on. No, stop being difficult. Just get in the portal. <laughs> Please. Why did it go through it just now? But not, not right now. I, I don't know what's doing. Come on. Get in. Get in the portal. Okay. Oh, there we go. And it did actually come out just now. So that is cool. Of course, we can get in you know, perfectly fine. Uh, so, oh yes, I wanted to try something with the black hole in the end. So, oh geez, this is going to be a little bit insane if this does actually work. So let's just quickly make the end portal very quickly. There we go. Place the eye of ender and there we go. All right, let's see. Oh my goodness, this is going to be insane. If it can kill the ender dragon just instantly, uh, that would be insane. Uh, do I even have it out? No, I don't. Oh, it's in perfect position right now. No, it's gonna move. Oh, I didn't mean to open that up. So, let's get, uh, the portal gun and, of course, the black hole. There we go. Alright, so, now we just need the dragon to come down a little bit. Because that's the only way it kind of, like, gets sucked up. So, and the dragon, please. <laughs> Let me just quickly break this so it just stops healing, at least. Stop healing, dragon! Stop it. No, you're not allowed to heal. No, 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 no. Bad dragon. Bad dragon. Please, just go on the floor. <laughs> please, pretty please. Oh, no. Okay, you know what? We might get a bow out and shoot at it just a little bit. 
Uh, and, and of course, you know, kind of breaking this. We can shoot at this as well. All right, come on, dragon. You have no more heals. Wait, actually, you have two more. <laughs> I lied. I lied for a second. And there we go. All right, sweet. Now, dragon, I'm going to shoot you a few times. All right. And I want you to just quickly come down to the middle and test out this black hole for me. So, come on, dragon. Stop being difficult. Oh, here we go. Let's try it. So, bam. There we go. <gasps> it actually worked. Guys. <laughs> Wait, what? The black hole can even get rid of the ender dragon instantly. Dude, that is actually insane. Oh, okay. And it can, of course, get rid of me. Okay, that is actually insane. Uh, so what if we try... Hmm, summon... Let's try the wither. Uh, there we go. Let's see, black hole. Nope, no, 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 no. We need the black hole. There we go. So for some reason, when you shoot it once, it changes back to just a normal one. So a little bit weird with that, but... Black hole. There we go. Come on. Ooh, it was close. It just needs to be a little bit closer. No. Can we spawn in multiple of these? Let's try. Oh, okay. Well, <laughs> yikes. It literally just died. <laughs> what? That is insane. Okay. Uh, we can maybe try doing summon Ender Dragon, I guess. Uh, there we go. Yeah, wait. Oh, that was close. I want to see if I can get myself up there from here. So we're going to shoot it to once here. So there we go. We got a blue portal. So if I was to like kind of like do that, where would that go? I don't know. Should we, should we try it? Where did that go? Oh, <laughs> what? Wait, hang on. Did it just, wait, can we actually do that? <laughs> that is awesome. Oh my goodness. Look at all of this XP just going down. So is it still up in the air? Oh, it is. <laughs> I mean, that would definitely kill you in, um, you know, survival, obviously. Uh, but yeah, very cool. There is one last thing I want to try out. How far can we actually teleport and shoot this thing? Uh, let's just kind of like shoot it like that. Where does that go? Does it ever go on the ground? Because I swear it doesn't. I think I'm going to be up in the air. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so it looks like it doesn't actually like come down i guess but we can shoot it a very far way so as you can see we can hit that tree possibly did we hit it or did i miss oh no we definitely got the tree all right let's see if we can like teleport from here dude i love this mod this is so cool like being able to teleport around the place so there we go we just came from the other side there we go that is so cool just make sure you aim it somewhere because if you shoot it up there uh then it looks like where is it Where's the portal? Can we actually see the portal in here? Oh, there it is! <laughs> it just never drops onto the ground. It's like it hits like an invisible wall or something. I have no idea. But does this actually do anything? No. Okay, we need to like shoot one down there. All right, let's just wait for that. Did it land somewhere? Can we can we teleport, please? Nope. Okay. <laughs> it's not going to work when we uh, start it from up there. But of course, we can do that and aim for that tree did i hit the tree yes i did perfect <laughs> all right guys so that is going to wrap up today's video if you guys enjoyed smash the like button right now subscribe to the channel if you are new all of that good stuff and i'll be leaving a link in the description down below to this awesome awesome mod and uh yeah thanks so much for watching and i'll see you guys in the next one peace see ya